Hey, Mark, good morning. Sorry for the early call. Uh, we were recently informed of a satellite breakup and uh, need to have you guys uh, start reviewing the safe haven procedure. It's uh, 9.21. Uh, we are planning on performing through block eight, which will include closing the radial hatches. Uh, the time of concern is 0600. Copy, 9.21. Uh, we're looking at executing that through step eight and including closing the lateral hatches and time of concern is 0600. Okay. That's a good read. Uh, we have a step on the ground to configure um, before you guys close those radial hatches. Uh, we will be sure to let you know when we are ready for you to perform your steps. Sounds good. Thanks for the heads up. To answer your question earlier about suits, we can support you getting into suits at your discretion. It's your call. Just to note that the Soyuz crew is not in suits. And then heads up 15 minutes to the next debris field past TCA. Endurance copies. It is the uh, conjunction is still yellow risk or has it changed? It's an equivalent yellow uh, for the next debris pass. And then also we, we are um, estimating that the probability of a hit to Dragon would be lower than the rest of ISS. And Houston Endurance, is uh, SpaceX on console to have a conversation on Dragon to Ground about forward actions if we do have a, a hit? And Endurance, also, Houston, yes, uh, SpaceX is on console. If it's under half an hour, we are thinking about coming back on the station. If it's more than half an hour, we are thinking to stay suited and potentially come back home. This is all if Dragon takes a hit. And Endurance, and, Houston, uh, alteration to that proposal, if if Dragon takes a hit, we will get you back on station. We'll come back on the station regardless if uh, Endurance takes a hit. And Endurance Houston on Sitzgram 1, just want to reiterate that we think it's small likelihood that Dragon would get an impact. Endurance copy, thanks.